All right, guys, welcome back to episode 78, I think. That sounds right, 78. Um, we are, I think, about to go talk to Lord Kortash, which is a little terrifying. But let's just go ahead and get it done, right? Better not be cursed. This is the audience chamber, and I think he is about to... <clears throat> oh, the audience hall is up here. Mizora's here? Oh, God. Wow, bunch of bodyguards. So I guess all the bodyguards hang out here while the lords themselves go upstairs. If it isn't little Will's chum. Yeah. I hope he hasn't been too much trouble. Heard about his father. The Dead Three's puppet. A travesty, really. Shut up. He's upstairs in Worm's Rock, ordaining Gortash as Archduke. <gasps> A splendid shindig, I hear. Perfect for crashing. Go on up. We'll talk after. And bring the pup along, if you can. I'd yeah. I'd hate for him to miss the fun. Yeah, we'll have to bring him. <clears throat> um, I think we have to leave someone behind. Um, we can, I think, oh, it's tough to determine who, sh who I should leave behind. Um, the advantage of these two is they're both Baldurians, I guess, I think is what they're called. Baldur's Gate citizens. Um, so I should be safe to leave either one of them. Um, probably leave Karlak, unfortunately. Never wanted the easy path. Because... Well, but she has a history with Mizora, so that could be useful. Asterion is like highbrow. I think I should leave Shadowheart behind, unfortunately. On my mind. Did you want something? If not, I'm perfectly happy to just gaze upon your work. Oh, the Sharns are using a place called the House of Grief as a cover for their presence in Baldur's Gate. She should know that she was with us. Then that's where we need to go. My parents are in there somewhere. Okay, I still need you to... Aren't you a sight for sore eyes? Mm-hmm. Uh, we should journey separately for now. I'll look for you there, or I'll look for you here if I need you again. If you're sure. I'm sure. Fine. I'll be here whenever you rediscover your taste in company. That's funny. Okay, Will. You're coming with us. I need to level you up as soon as I get you. Men, women, children, all barred from entry. A damn travesty. A decade ago, Baldur's Gate would have welcomed any and everyone seeking refuge. Who would take in these souls, if not the Jewel of Baldurin? Um... Uh, perhaps we can reason with the leadership. <laughs> Gortash, do you mean? Those metal hunks do not obey a man who sees reason. There is no negotiating with the dead gods is chosen. They know only the language of punishment and pain. To make Baldur's Gate a safe haven, we'll first need to bathe Gortash and Orin in their own blood. Could it be true Duke Stelmane allied with the Emperor? Mind flayers are like devils. They just sport tentacles rather than wings. So the answer is yes. Manipulative, exploitative. The Emperor says he's a friend. I think we'd be fools to believe him. Maybe it's true. Maybe Stelmane allied with a mind flayer and subjected the city to their political will. Or maybe he made an offer she couldn't refuse. Yeah. Did you know uh, Stelmane very well back in the day? I met her twice. The first time, I was a boy of seven or eight at a banquet in the Flaming Fist's honor. One look and I was smitten. Chestnut hair that flowed behind her like willow fronds mm. as she floated from one room to the next as if carried by clouds. The second time, Stelmane was different. Even with the aid of a cane, 
Each step she took was a struggle. Interesting. Every word she spoke took great physical effort. A stroke victim? I asked father later. No, he said. A stroke survivor. Damn. Any idea who could be behind the killing? I couldn't say. But think about this. My father was Tadpole. Stelmane is dead. The people are frightened and the council's in disarray. Mm -hmm. To exert control, he must first sow chaos. A tyrant strategy, as father would say. These murders aren't random acts. Someone powerful is guiding the killer's hand. And the city is made weaker for it. I'd like you to join me. That's the spirit. Okay, let's level up Will really quickly. He's got like three or four levels. Level eight, level, so three levels. A new feat available. Hey, okay, he is a warlock. Um, let's just do, you get a spell. Um, let's do Fire Shield. Ooh, Hellish Rebuke is good. We're gonna do that. No, we're gonna do Fire Shield. Uh, we're gonna replace the spell. Yeah, I knew I was focusing mostly on fire for him, because it's just a fun theme, and he's got a devil for a patron. So, we will ditch Armor of Agathis... And we will get Hellish Rebuke. And then for your feet. Um, let's go ahead and do... We could just do an ASI and bump his Charisma up to 20. Um, that's pretty good. Let's do that. Actually, Agonizing Blast. Yeah, let's do that. Level 9. He gets another Eldritch Invocation and Spells. So for Spells, we're going to go Flame Strike. That's specific to his patron. And for the Eldritch Invocation, we are going to... Um, nope. Fiendish Vigor. Repelling Blast. That's what we're going to do. And then level 10. What is this? Fiendish Resilience. Choose a damage type and become resistant to it. You can pick a new damage type. Each short rest. Whoa. Okay. Uh, new Cantrip. Let's do... This is actually kind of tough. Let's do friends, just because I can't remember if... I don't think it's Shadow Heart, actually. So let's do True Strike. It's unfortunately an action. Uh, but that's okay. Nah, let's do... Minor Illusion. And then for a spell, let's go ahead and do... I thought I already had Hellish Rebuke. Let's do Hold Monster. Okay. So that's done. 
Um, he is level 10. Let's leave camp. Oh, we need to equip him just in case. Yeah, he's got crap for gear. Um, let's just try and really quickly here. Just get some equipment. Uh, he doesn't even have a magical weapon. Um, let's select Will. While you were drunk? Wow, okay. Sorrow? Oh yeah, I forgot about this. Okay. Not proficient with that. Minus one intelligence, minus one wisdom, plus two strength. No, he uses dexterity. We want something that's versatile. Extra reach could be good. Um, that's really good. Do you have anything? Not really. Um, really? Okay. You can have 1d4 bonus to all checks. That's really good. Uh, protection, that's fine. What is this? Um, when you inspire an ally using bard. Yeah, he's not a bard. I think I originally thought he was a bard, but he is in fact not. Let's give him Misty Step. It seems more useful than this. Um, his boots are currently nothing, so we'll give him that. Uh, let's give him this glaive, I guess, because it's better than what he's got. And then for range, just in case he needs it, um, let's give him... Do I have any other good bows? Oh, I forgot I picked this up. This is uh, Ketherick's armor. What are we looking at here? Visibility and blur. I forgot that we weren't wearing that. Come on. There we go. That was weird. Um, I want to get rid of this. We've got to have something better. This could be fun. Who knows? All right, uh, let's just go with this. This is fine. I, I don't want to spend forever working on this. Um, whatever bow I have. Are you proficient in that? Sweet. Um, I'm content with what you're wearing. Uh, maybe we'll give you this plus one bonus to spell save DCs when threatened. Um, very situational. We probably won't ever be threatened. Uh, he shouldn't be in melee combat, but... Um better than plus one intimidation, so. Okay. Up we go. Oh, uh, first. Go on up, pay Gortash a visit. A fate to remember, I guarantee. Okay, so nothing to say. Let's go up. Um, nope, we found it already, damn. Can I still quick save before it gets to, yeah, let's quick save here.
damn. This is freaking intimidating, dude. All right, let's go. Just march right on up. King's people, Baldurians, and dearest Duke Ravengar, thank you for joining me on this exceptional day. It's him, Gortash. Yep. <sighs> this is it. I can practically taste his blood. This is me. not it, Karlak. My father's here, Karlak. Cool your fires. He must not come to harm. Yeah. Uh, does it say anything specific? No, they're both careful, Carl. Like the Stillwatch would destroy us in one swipe if we attack Gortash here. Yeah. Ooh, ooh. We don't use friends on friends. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, thank goodness. So we bide our time, but make no mistake, that monkey is mine. Oh, yeah, 100%. He's yours. A moment, please, my friends. An old acquaintance has come to pay her respects. Oh, you fucker. Please, Karlak. Come and say a proper hello. What a dick. My respects? You're lucky I've agreed not to shove my boot up your... Ah, how I've missed your colourful turns of phrase. We must catch up just as soon as I've had words with your little friend. As for you, I understand congratulations are in order. Thorm's defeat hasn't gone unnoticed. You're known for who you are and for that netherstone that you carry. Mm -hmm. The quakes are a clear warning. If nobody steps in soon, it'll free itself from the authority of the crown. I expect it'll start with turning the sword coasts infected. You among them. A prism of yours won't last indefinitely. Next, the grand design. The Mind Flayer Empire reborn. If we're lucky, we'll become slaves. If we're unlucky, well, not the most thrilling of prospects, but it's a fate that can be avoided. If you and I come to an understanding, together we can uh -huh. still restore authority over the brain. Called it. Of course. Gortash always did have an eye for opportunity. I'm not interested in bargaining with the likes of you. The likes of you stand to benefit from the likes of me. There's an old wisdom. A brittle alliance can never be mended. It can only break. With Ketherick gone, Orin proved treacherous. Baal's chosen wants the Neverstones for herself. She only cares for blood. And your blood and mine are of particular interest to her. God damn it, he's right. What are you getting at? We should team up Orin against her. What are you getting faster at? faster than you and I change clothes. You know, she's tricked you before. She's targeted me as well. I'm well protected, but she's extremely good at what she does. If Orin obtains all three Netherstones, she'll plunge the coast into chaos and paint the city in blood. I can't let that happen. I want to lead this city to glory, not scorch its earth. See, I think he's right. He does want to lead the city to glory, but his methods in doing so are heinous at best. You want me to believe you mean no harm to the city? I'd like to propose a pact. A divine oath sworn upon spirit and flesh. I do no harm to you, nor you to me. 
Furthermore, you'll have nothing to fear from my steel watch while our pact stands. Thorm's stone is yours to keep. When you slay Orin and take her stone, you bring it here. So the three are united once again. Together, we rule Faerun as kings. No, more than kings. <laughs> Gods. We rule as the absolute. And my father? Your father will do whatever you command him to. Like any other subject in our kingdom. No. What do you say? Shall we be allies? I can detect no deceit. This alliance could serve us well. And if it does not, well, we need not honor it. Yeah, that's kind of my thoughts too. Hmm. Let's be allies, said the viper to the frog. She's not wrong. Um, let's try to detect thoughts. 13 is not very high, but we only get plus one, and I do have inspiration, which is technically advantage. And we're gonna need it. <clears throat> do I have more than one inspiration, though? Oh, I'm full. I'm fully stocked. Great. Well, I need one or two more rolls to get this. Natural. Oh, I'm so good at this. God. Orin is unreliable. This one. This one shows promise. He keeps his word, I keep mine. We will rule as one. Wow. Wow. I'll think about it, no promises? That's rough. I don't want to say this, but she'll be pissed. To hell's with your pact? Can't say this. Jeez. This game really knows how to put you in a, in a tough spot. I'll think about it, but no promises. I, I, I feel like that's what I have to go with. Perhaps a demonstration of why you need my help will motivate you to make the right decision. Your camp is compromised. One among you is an imposter, a faceless. The child, maybe? Who, I can't say. I'd suggest a thorough investigation. You'll find I speak the truth. An imposter? But who in the hells? The faceless in your camp is like a knife <clears throat> at your throat. Remove it quickly. Or any alliance between us would yeah, be exceedingly short-lived. How am I supposed to find Orin if she can change her form so easily? Even horror has a home. Find her nest and slay her there. Makes sense. For all its charms... Baldur's Gate has long had a cancer in its heart. A hidden temple devoted to Baal. That's where Orin wow. became what she is. Where she worshipped and schemed. And now, it's where she hides from my watchers. When she's not spilling blood in the streets. You're resourceful. I trust you'll sniff it out. If the trail goes cold, follow the bodies. Why is the crown failing? It's not, but it will not <clears throat> follow new orders unless the Neverstones are united to give the command. Yeah. When it finishes executing its current orders, it will be free to do as it wishes. That will be bad for everyone. Once it is freed from its shackles, I doubt we'll ever be able to bring it under control again. <sighs> All right, I must go. Before you do, come and witness. As I make history as the first Archduke of Baldur's Gate.
I have no interest in this sham of a ceremony. That's. I feel like Carlac would really like that. I feel like Will would really like that. Um, I feel like Asterion doesn't really have an opinion to that. We'll do this. Fine, let's get it over with. You will follow me, and you will show due respect. Yeah. Distinguished dukes, patriarchs, dearest Raven Guard. Cut his head off. Oh, wait. Your call. A new chapter begins. Enver Gortash, swearest thou by Baldurin's blade to defend the citizens of Baldur's Gate from enemies within and without? I swear. I think he does, too. Swearest thou true faith and fealty to the same by word, deed, and decree so that none may suffer? I swear. Gathered guests, grant ye consent. Say nothing. Enver Gortash, the council appoints you Archduke of Baldur's Gate. See, the problem here is that he probably believes what he says. My friends, the Steel Watch stands ready. Let its blade fall on any who would diminish our city. And you, honored guest, will find me in my office above when you return. Do not come empty-handed. I feel like he believes what he said. Jeez, he's got a lot of hit points. Um, the problem is that, like, he's got Ravenguard under his command, and he probably doesn't consider what he's doing to Ravenguard to be, like, making him suffer. He probably considers it pity. You know what I mean? Next, we identify all enemies within our walls. They will be imprisoned until they prove loyal. Alright, Duke, you've got your son here. Let's talk. Truest of souls, bathed in her light. There is a fleeting connection. Your parasite communes with his, then falls quiet. Father, my dearest boy, the hells have touched you, but you've come to me just as Gortas said you would. A true soul, no less. Father and son, unstoppable generals. Mm. You and your allies will usher in a new dawn. I don't think he is himself, right? I'm here to help you, Florix sent me. Help me? Ah, the Black Widow caught you in her web. Florix chose shadow over light. Her betrayal burned deeper than the fires of Avernus. Damn. She's been punished for her lies. Don't let her get to you. When he says punished, do you think he means locked up or brutally murdered? What have you done to Floric? I stilled her tongue. That's the end of the matter. Why can't I just detect thoughts, dude? I hate using my Illithid to do this stuff. It's gonna be really high too. Oh, two. Okay, never mind. Just don't roll a one, dude. Great. All right. Within Ravenguard's memories, you find Counselor Floric. There we go. She is confined in a cell right here in Worm's Rock. The sun rises, mm. true soul. Are you ready? Gortash is a tyrant and his new dawn is a lie. Why do you say this? Only the shadows would name the sun a tyrant. 
Faerun suffers in darkness. Tyr has abandoned us. Helm's eye has strayed. But Baldur's Gate will soon burn bright, a beacon to light the heavens. And it will be Gortash who ignites the final spark. No, this isn't him. Yeah. This is the tadpole talking. Yeah. For a brief moment, uncertainty clouds his mind, then dissipates. The astral prism vibrates in concord. Yeah. What nonsense is this. I... The prism quivers once more. Raven Guard falters. Yeah. As I said, Baldur's Gate will ascend to Rill's first and only grand city. Yeah, let's. I guess we want to keep doing this. I don't want to like hurt him. I don't think that it will. A two again? Yeah, you just don't roll a one. Dude, that's so insane. First comes a vision of terror. Yeah. The city of Baldur's Gate taken by lithids. But beyond the terror, there is hope. You see a beaming raven guard presiding over the sunlit city, applauded by the people. A people at peace. The true raven guard lurks somewhere in this infected mind, seeking freedom, seeking victory. Have we finished then? Yeah. <sighs> okay, let's come down here. Oh wow, look at this. Dang, this is cool, man. Doors I'm not supposed to go through. Um, more doors I'm probably not supposed to go through. Let's actually come back up here really quick. Oh, I want to talk to these other lordlings. Yeah, they don't want me to explore any of this. Let's talk to these people, see if they're just as brainwashed as Raven Guard. Raven Guard has not once failed this city. If he trusts Gortash, yeah. then so do I. Oh, that's so tragic. Archduke Gortash, man of the people, the right people. <laughs> An Archduke. Finally, someone who can stand up to those wretched absolutists. Whew, I've got some bad news for you. You're going to become an absolutist if he has his say. What glory, our city. And what glory, its future. Okay. Chatter shield. The Steel Watch has made an impenetrable fortress out of the Sword Coast Crown Jewel. I can't think of a better endorsement for Gortash than that. Hmm. Interesting. Servant. Mm-hmm. That's it. Just mm-hmm. Away, if you please. I am here at the service of Lady Birch. Okay. And a Gortash was safe. More to the point, my fortunes are safe. Yeah. Oh, there's Lady Birch. The Absolute's blight will be a hard one to cure. Gortash is the Archduke for the job. Oh, these people have I no idea. Everything's such a bother. The city is only as strong as its walls. Gortash understands this. Yeah. I am at my lady's service, and hers alone. Okay. A good leader knows when to step aside. Ravenguard did the right thing. Oh, jeez. 
These people have no idea. What are they thinking? Giving a fellow like that such power? I give him a year at most. So far, we've seen one sensible person here. My lady. A commoner made Archduke of Baldur's Gate. I never thought I'd see the day. I never thought I'd see the day. All right. Um, yeah, pretty interesting stuff. Uh, let's talk to a couple more people and then our companions. Finally, a leader with some charisma. Ravenguard was quite the dullard. The dullard. It's funny. Archduke Gortash. Now there's a man who knows good business. God, the voice... The voice cast for this game has just been fantastic. Um, do I just want to go through and talk to all these freaking people again? I don't think that I do. Hopefully you guys don't. Okay. Let's stand here. Let's quick save. Let's talk to Will and Dr. Karlak. Will first. Incredible. To hear my father's voice speak those words. Yeah. Like a stranger wrapped in his flesh. But there's still a glimmer of him in there, calling for release. I feel it. I know it. I won't let the Absolute keep him. This is my pledge. Wow, okay, that was it. So there you have it. Lord Enver Gortash in all his glory. What did you make of him? He seemed like an absolute fraud in a very nice coat. Yeah. Fucker always had expensive taste. Huh. I don't know how anyone in this hall could fall for this charade. Isn't it obvious what a chancer he is? When people are scared, they'll do whatever it takes to feel safe. And they expect these big metal monsters to tuck them in at night while the absolute knocks on the gates. If only they knew the truth. The Dead Three orchestrated all of this. And it's working. I wish this city, the people running it, were smarter than me. Gortash isn't their salvation. He's the monster at the gate. I mean, he's the Emperor creating the Separatist army and then protecting it with the Republic. Oh, like... I'm a Star Wars fan, guys, and, and he is... Gortash is Emperor Palpatine, right? He orchestrated an army to attack the city and then promised that he and only he could protect the city. What's not to... Like, and people believe it, you know what I mean? All right, Mizzoro. What do you have for us? What did I tell you? A momentous occasion. I'm sure you agree. I've had enough, Mizora. What do you want? For your attention, little pup. Nothing more. And you'll be glad to give it. You see, Gortash has had your father relocated. What are you playing at, devil? Relocated? Rude. I'm just an impartial observer. This is Gortash's game. A murderous one, the way I hear it. Shit. Your dad's good as dead, pup. And to think, there's no way to save Oh, him. what a bitch. Or is there? You know something. I know enough. I'll be in your camp if you want to work something out. God damn it. God damn it. Of course she'd stick her infernal nose where it doesn't belong. Of course she's dreamt up some risible scheme. By all the hounds of the hells, what is she planning?
Mizora's up to nothing good, that's for certain. Certainly not. But she's as inevitable as Toril's path around the sun. We'll have answers soon enough. Mazora's gone to camp. We should speak with her. Until then, may my father keep safe, whatever coop he's been flown to. Well... Oh, what is all this? Crates the vegetables. Uh, hey, Asterion. Don't touch me. Step quick. Mm -hmm. Asterion. Um. Like a wraith. Oh, I thought that was gonna be a lot more. Oh, careful! Don't get caught. Good job, dude. Still alive. Okay. Best be on my way. A lever. Really? Ah, there's a secret path down here. Oh, this is probably the secret entrance. Huh. Well, that's good to know. What else is over here? Uh, lemon, kiwi, cabbage, bunch of random stuff we don't care about. Here's the kitchen. Let's talk to the cook. What's up for discussion? Ruff's bubbly, no time to talk. Yeah, I figured as much. Okay. A couple great swords just laying there. Alright, let's get that guy out of here. Um, can we... Oh, there's the city. What's this plaque say? Well, most people Flaming are Fist Barracks. Authorized personnel only. Who's this? Lord Gortash? Oh yeah, we do want to do that, but not right now. Don't close the door, come on. Blaze Savora, who are you? Keep those feet moving. Yes, ma'am. Okay, whatever. To the lower city. Heck yeah, dude. What's this? Looks like nothing. How about this? A couple citizens. All right, let's go to the lower city. Oh, free counselor for it. Maybe. Well, no, I don't think we have enough time. Oh, different region. Jeez. Okay. Let's not do that quite yet. Um, this is. Can I see? No, I cannot. Killed a few giant bats in my day. Flaming fist. Flaming fist. fist. Okay. Authorized what's... personnel only. Oh, I think this is all there. It won't count. It's not locked, though. Like, the door's not red, so it's not like we're not allowed in here. I'm happy to recommend one. The house was on fire. We were rescuing people. The ancient sigil. Okay, we don't actually need that. We want to go down to the basement, or the... whatever it's called. The prison. The dungeon. So let's talk to this person. Arclea, uh, Alora, or Orla, or Olorel. Not a bloody open house. Fists only. Now clear off. I'd like to trade. Trade. Oh shit. Do I look like a shopkeeper? This equipment isn't for sale. It belongs to the Flaming Fist. Let's do this. 10 plus 1. I'm not very good at those. Okay, let's see. 2. I'm, I'm curious enough, I'm willing to use some inspiration for this. Let's go. 50 50 chance. There we go. It's actually like 45 65 in my favor, but. Or 45 55 in my favor. 
can't believe they put that mindless metal Ragresham in my armory. Steel watchers. Stupid thing will probably decapitate me for cleaning the bloody mace rack. Ah, steel watchers make me uneasy. A good weapon in my palm would put my mind at rest. Finally, someone who sees sense. Strong folk wielding strong blades. That's what keeps folk safe. Not those glorified golems. I don't have anything fancy, but... They're welcome to take a look. All right, don't have anything fancy. Okay, breastplate plus two, scale metal plus... Yeah, it's all just plus two. Yeah, that makes sense. Plus one. Okay. Pretty basic stuff. Uh, monstrosities, undead, and construct. Okay. Do I have anything that I can sell? Not particularly. Okay, that's fine. I guess that's all for naught, but... Stay sharp, stranger. In these times, all we can trust are the blades in our hands. Okay. Let's quick save and then go down the passageway. I just... It doesn't appear like there's any reason why I can't go down there, but sure enough, I'll go down there and they'll be like, what are you doing here? Okay. Breva, Bright Moon, sleeping. Better be cautious. Free for the taking. Okay. If this isn't important. Negative two. come over here and can you potion of invisible I only have two okay where's it at right there um that and then hopefully this doesn't wake them up um beautiful i have something to ask okay so we have a very limited amount of time here let's have some fun Asterion, let's have you come this way. Balazar, you can come this way. Light on my feet. Will, welcome to the party. You've not done this before. Come this way. Carlac. You can come this way. Shadowlack. Shadowlack. I freaking love her, dude. She's so funny. You're gonna come over this way. Should be fine. Just like old times. Beautiful. Pickpocket. It's going to pass. Negative three. Okay, this is a storage room key. Uh, let's do this one first. What Success. Oh, we can just do a bunch of it all at once. Okay, I'm not even going to try and take the prison key because there's a chance every time we do this we can roll a one. But that's good. Oh, and he's no longer invisible. So that's the result of me doing what I just did, which is not good. So let's have you uh, just get the heck away from this guy. Um, oh, 
couple of people there. Let's um, come this way. Can you just stand here? Should still be hiding. Good. Uh, Salazar, you can still move quite a bit. Um, out of sight, out of mind. Let's just end our turn for everybody. He's gonna move. Okay. Now I want him with the keys to a bonus action dash all the way down here. And when you get down here, kill the lights. Open the door and look at that. We got all this cool stuff that we can find. Uh, I want you to go like this and shut the door. Balazar. Uh, let's have you. What's over here? Nothing good. Something's on my mind. Uh, let's have all of you guys just come this way. Ready. Well. And Carlac. Carla, can you sneak, come sneak. over here? Actually, come this way. Kill the torches. I shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. Okay, and our turns. Still Oops. breathing. We find everything. There you go. Unless you think my good helmet grew legs and walked off. Don't be daft. Got me left in a Charess's caress after a slug of Hoot's latest hooch. Maybe right. One sip, and the world goes all fuzzy. Like I'm dreaming. But awake. That's some Okay. Um. Yeah, let's just keep Oh, what's this? Oh, a nice little secret spot. That's good to know, in case we need to like hide somewhere quickly. Carlac, you're gonna dash. You should still be invisible, right? Thank goodness. You're gonna come over here. I'm nothing. Um, Balazar, you're gonna also dash. And you're gonna uh, come up here. Should be fine. And move. And will. Uh, let's get a little extra there. Okay, you're gonna run. Oh, that was weird. Bad roll. Oh, okay. Um, here we're just gonna have you. Can you double dash? Oh, he is a bard. I'll be damned. Can you just, like, book it all the way to this corner? While you're doing that, Balazar, you can just end your turn where you're at. You can come a little bit further, I guess. There she is. Oh, auto? No. I don't see Counselor Fork. Okay, end your turn. Eyes open, mouth shut. Oh, there she is. Okay. Uh, end your turn. And then you, you get to just loot everything. Um, starting with this wooden chest. Dang! Whoa, a lot of good stuff here. I'll take it all. 
Um, put out the campfire. Put out. Yeah, you have plenty of movement, dude. Put out the grazer. Come up here. Uh, sprint with your bonus action. You're just like full blown. How quickly can I get through everything? That's your goal. Turns out, in fact, pretty quickly. All right, so you're done. Um, and then let's immediately finish. Well, that guy barely moved. Interesting. Okay, you're gonna come down here and loot this. And send it to camp. That's fine. Um, you're gonna open this door. And you're just gonna just go as fast as you can. Close that. You're gonna sprint just over to this hiding spot here. Eventually you'll get there. And then this guy hopefully won't turn around too quickly. Um, are you obscured? Lightly obscured? Maybe I should have done that differently. Should be fine. All right. What now? Um. Carlac, let's have you sprint over to here. Turn down the fire. I'm guessing there's a way. To break out of one of these cells because usually the player gets shoved in one. Well, no, maybe not actually. Um, oh, yeah, that's what I wanted. Okay, hopefully that doesn't do no anything too crazy. Uh, let's dash. Uh, just come over here, I guess. I hopefully this guy will turn around soon. Um, just get as close as you can, I guess. You are invisible for another, what, eight turns? Seven turns? So you're done. Let's go. You're done. You're done. Please don't open that door. Okay. Looking ahead. Balazar, I want you to dash. Come over here. One day I'll catch a break. And then can you, even though you're invisible, talk to her? Let's get this guy. Ooh, cutting it real, real narrow, but that's okay. You're just gonna full blown sprint right over here. Stay low. Prison log. We were never here. Okay, so he's done. Can you, while you're invisible, talk to this person? You might as well lock the cell. You're too late. It's over. By Avernus. Floric. Will. Is that you? What curse has befallen you? No matter. The city. The future. It's done. Counselor, what happened to you? The Steel Watch happened. I came seeking allies to our cause. Watchers spotted me, dragged me to Alder Ravenguard's husk, empty as a stair. Uh huh. Your father's a tadpole's puppet, Will. Nothing more. He spoke in accusations apostasy, conspiracy, sedition. I'll be executed in five dawns. 
You might have unlocked my cell, but there's no escape from this place. The hell's with that. Nothing is over. Not while I still draw breath. I'm breaking you out. Baldur's Gate needs you. Raven Guard needs you. <laughs> Just don't roll a natural one. Four. That was close. But we're good. When the people need a miracle, you cannot wait for the gods to answer. That's right. Father's words. Wow. Indeed. To think I'd almost forgotten. No more sulking. I know what to do. And I can only do it with the help of the blade. Lead me from my cell. Escort me out of Worms Rock. I'll seek out my connections. When the city streets shatter, you'll want their blades. Follow me. Okay, we're gonna have to figure this out. This is gonna be tough. Well done. Lead the way. Um, I think... Oh. That's not good. My turn. Are they all gonna attack? I think they are. Damn, I was really hoping to avoid this. So, first things first. Um, Non-lethal. Makes the most sense. Uh, Floric is also non-lethal. We don't actually want to kill these people. Um, how did Karlak lose her stealth. Oh, that's how. Okay. Um, temporarily hostile. Yeah, we're just gonna um, go ahead and just try and wail on these people. Level 10, 43 points. He's a wizard. Two hits should be all it takes from Karlak. And that's gonna take a little more. That's okay. Let's uh, do another one. And then you can rage. Yeah, you can rage. Um, who's this person? Uh, let's actually really quickly. I was trying to concentrate. Mysterian, just close the door. This person doesn't need to uh, know what's going on. Actually, better yet, why don't we open that? Why don't you come in here? Why don't we close that? And then why don't you uh, come over here? Step carefully. Because these guys are all gonna come flying out of there. Uh, let's have you come on this side. Because then you're going to be totally obscured, and then we'll wait a little bit before these guys can, right, Karlak, it's go time. can do anything. Well, uh, oh, he's stuck right now. He's not in combat. Come on, can't stay idle. It's actually pretty good. Uh, Floric, she's going much later. Will. Let's have you pickpocket. No, we've already, we don't need to do that. We've already pickpocketed this guy. Uh, can you... I just, I don't want to screw this up. Uh, and... Must be unarmed or using a melee weapon. Doesn't work on undead and constructs. Must be unarmed or using a melee weapon. Right. So it doesn't work on ranged attacks. We figured that out with Asterion a while ago. So yeah, go ahead and put this dude down. Knocked out. Temporary. Which is great. Uh, Karlak. Uh, why don't you... Oh, we're gonna lose both of those. Really? Nothing? Okay, you're done. These guys are all gonna sprint over. Jump. Cute. Uh, 
Sacred Flame. Um. Yeah, I don't think we need to react. Seven damage. She can handle it. She's tough. She's a tough cookie. Um. Will. You've technically already attacked. What do you what bonus actions do you have, if any? Like none. Okay. Alright. Let's have you um just come forward a little bit. Coming through. So that we can actually attack these guys. Uh that's good enough. Still on the feet. You, Balazar, are going to 64 hit points. He can handle three of these. Great. Now just get as close as you can. We're going to end your turn. Uh, you are going to just run this way. Eleven. What are you? Oh, I can't. Humanoid elf, advisor. Elf humanoid. Interesting. Okay, whatever. Um. Yeah, you can end your turn. These jumps, it's funny. Browbeaten? What does that mean? Oh, that's right, because he's in melee, so he's he's good to go. Um, yeah, you're gonna do two hits on this guy. Uh, let's have you run this way. Nothing in there. Well, on this guy. One. Two. Okay, so we have to do melee on this guy. We don't want to do a ranged attack, because that could kill them. So you're done. Uh, yep. Off balance, that's fine. Ooh, that's not so fine. Um, you... Oh god, I love, like, weapons of breach. Not quite enough. Okay, Balazar. Uh, 20%? Oh god, I hate when we forget to do this, man. That is so frustrating. So, we're gonna just use all three of these on this guy. So irritating, man. Take one of those, end your turn. Will is also done. Grovel? Um, Will, counterspell that. Thank you, sir. Okay, she should be able to put this guy at 40%. Please put this guy down. Nice. Dead? What? Oh, no. Dang it. Really not what I wanted to do. Um, dang it. Oh well. That sucks a lot. Um, let's have Will attack first. 50%. That's really good. Alizar. Um, let's do two of these and one on this guy. Well done. You're done. Um, you are, I believe, also done. Yep. And you are gonna hopefully kill him in one. Okay. Uh, we don't need that. Can you get over here? You cannot. Can you jump over there? You can. Can you pounce? Yes, go for it. Saved. Okay, that's fine. 
It's like a free... It's a free thing to do that, so we might as well every time, right? You're done. Attack. Uh, what is this? Oh yeah, you're gonna encounter spell. I'm not gonna react. And that ends your turn, dude. You are screwed. Uh, Floric, you... You can dash. Just try and get out of here. You're done. Uh, Karlak, you're gonna be the one that wraps that up. Will. You can bonus action dash. You've got a 50% chance to hit this guy. I kind of need him to hit. Great. That's exactly what I wanted. Come over here. Uh, and then Carlyne, you should be able to finish this off. Go Reckless. And then... One more should knock him out. Very well. Okay, let's loot this guy. Please. Don't need any of that. What can we steal from in here? Anything good? No. Okay. Well, let's go. Um, everybody group up. Everybody crouch. Um, this could be a problem uh, getting out of here because... We're gonna take her upstairs and everybody's gonna be like, well, what the hell's going on? And that could be very messy. Um, let's actually deep and move. Let's actually do this. Is there any way out of here? I don't see anything. I have a weird idea that I really want to try, um, and I want to do it now before I forget it. So let's have everybody crouch. Let's get in and out. Um, she is not crouching, which is a problem. So we need to tell her to do it. Out of sight. Uh, drink one of those. Open that. Everybody come this way. Everybody come this way. Get here. We're gonna quick save. What do we have here? Uh, we're gonna have her stop crouching, I think. And then we're gonna have taking my time in the shadows. We literally only have one of these. Um Touch a creature to turn it invisible. It's a concentration spell. So we're gonna look at our items. We're going to use it on her. We're gonna pause and she's only hidden for 10 turns. So we need to immediately get out of here. Uh, we don't want anybody to be right. crouching. But she's still following us, so we need to get out of here as fast as possible. I to ask. And I think we need to go... Um, missing pigeons... Where does she want us to take her? Um, Rescue the Grand Duke. Oh, here we go. We promised to break her out of Wormrock to prevent her impending execution. 
she needs an escape route. Okay, so it didn't say anywhere specific. Let's just, I guess, just try and run as fast as we can. Oh, wait. If we just exit turn based mode, can we just teleport right away? Just go to like Rivington? Let's try it. I'm a fist. Now's not the time for wandering. You can explore once I'm out of Worms Rock. Oh, God. Okay, so we gotta we gotta run. We gotta run, we gotta run, we gotta run. Eight turns, seven turns, six turns. This is far enough. Okay. The way should be clear. I can't thank you enough. Cool, easy. For getting me out of that damned prison. And for giving me courage. When I'd all but run out. It's the least we could do. Your faith in this city should inspire us all. What will you do now? I will travel to the upper city. Find what allies I can. You won't fight the coming battle alone. As long as the city stands, I will stand with it. This is my promise. Okay. Oh yeah, dude. Okay, that actually worked a lot better than uh, I thought it was going to. And technically we didn't kill anybody. Technically Flora did. <laughs> technically. So we'll leave it at that. Um, on that note, uh, I am going to go to camp. Hopefully it doesn't auto play a cutscene. Fantastic. This is probably our um, spy. Um, where is Mizora? Oh, that's kind of cool. Look at that. She should be over here somewhere, I would think. She said she was... Oh, maybe it's like one of those things where you have to end the day and then she'll show up. Um, Will? Well met. Um, I'd like you to wait in Make camp. Sure. The blade stands at the ready. And just when things were warming up. Yeah, sorry, dude. Um, he can keep that weapon for now, Shadowheart. Will ought to know what happened with Mizora. Whatever she has in store for him can't be good. Join me. All right. Some company wouldn't hurt on the road, especially if there's trouble. Okay. Um, yeah, we're going to end the episode here. Uh, I'm not sure. Oh, we should take Jahara with us and head back to the um, that merchant that was selling weapons and whatnot. Maybe we'll do that next episode. Uh, next episode for me is probably going to be a week or so. i um, going on vacation, so sorry for the wait, but uh, maybe maybe it'll go quicker for you. Maybe the episode's already uploaded. <laughs> um, on that note, thanks for tuning in, guys, and until next time. Sweet. <laughs> until next time, guys. Peace.